Hey there, welcome back guys. In this video, we're gonna show you how to remove the prime tower. That's right, you're trying to get rid of it. Maybe you're not crazy about it like me. Anyway, without any further ado, come, let's get started. Let's get rid of that. But just remember, when you do get rid of it, you lose print quality. But if you're not crazy about the quality, then you're fine. All right, knowing that, moving forward. See here, this is the prime tower. Um, you can delete it. No, so what you wanna do is you're gonna go into the menu, select your object of desire that you're gonna be printing. And the prime tower only appears on multicolor prints. And as you can see, here it is. But you're like, wait, where it is it? I'm in the menu, but I don't see it. Select global, okay? And then right here, see? This is the, looks like the world, but it's supposed to be, but it says multi-filament. So make sure you select multi-filament and you deselect it and voila. Now, if you want to add an object of desire there to replace that, um, you would just right click your print, right? And select clone and select okay. And then put this right here. And then um, you would enable uh, your, your uh, prime tower and then select right here, flush into object and then deselect there, then voila, prime tower is gone. Just make sure the height is comparable to that of the object you're printing. Can't print something like flat, flatter than what's already there. So if you're wondering what that is, we cannot put something like this there. Uh, where did it go? The fish. I even know it stands tall and proud before being eaten. See, flat, can't do that like that. So we'll just get rid of it and boom, it's gone. Yep, it is. We compare like a three card Monte, like where did it go? Uh, so actually this one goes here, that one goes there, and the red line right here means that's the build plate. In case you're wondering, shift and slide will move your board left and right, up and down. And that's pretty much it. That is how you remove the prime tower. We can always put it back, and if you do put it back, just remember to move whatever is out of the way and delete whatever, you know, you were going to do to have it replace that. And that's pretty much it. Kind of neat, huh? Anyway, I hope this video helped you. If you have any comments or questions, feel free to leave them down below or ideas for other videos. Remember to like and subscribe, and I'll see you all next time.